What first date behavior is a deal breaker? Once I told a guy he had something in his teeth and he flossed with his long hair. Introducing me to your boyfriend. Constantly being on your cell phone. Seriously, man, that's so uncool. Showing up late and not texting ahead of time. You're not playing it cool if you're 20 minutes late without saying anything. Taking me to a multi-level marketing seminar. Actually happened. Forgetting to take off your wedding ring. Removed. Starting the date by saying that you've cleared your entire weekend. Just in case this date works out and I'm free. No pressure. They won't stop talking about their ex. Smelly. Greasy hair. And no effort in appearance. If the first date ISNT important enough for you to even shower, then how important will the relationship be to you? Texting their ex. Too handsy right out the gate. You're still basically a stranger. I need to get to know you first. Telling me she has to be home by 10 o'clock because she has another date. Yep, it happened. Thanks Alice. I didn't know this until recently. Picking wax out of your ears and sprinkling it around. Don't. Just don't. Okay. Immediately starting with the I love you attitude. Passing out in their own vomit. Assuming they're going to have sex with me before I've made it clear. McDonald's. Lacking respect for servers and other working people. Asking to suck his dick before even having a real conversation. This actually happened. To this day, I still don't know how to say his name or where is he from. Completely different beliefs and politics. I've had multiple guys bring me a Bible and segue into asking me to dinner to teach me about that. Lord, they never understood why I wasn't excited. Talking about their junk. You'd be surprised how many seemingly normal men do this. General assault and murder and stuff. Frowned upon. Rudeness to anyone. They're supposed to be on the best behavior at this time. So it's a major red flag if they're not trying to be. Being petty about the $5 you spent on me even though I didn't ask you to. Showing up while eating Taco Bell nachos and asking if I want to go to his place. If he comes to pick you up and pees in your driveway before you'll leave. Showing up absolutely hammered and passing out within an hour. Narcissism. Rudeness. Talking about all the conspiracy theories they believe in. No. Chas. It isn't a commonly held belief that all of the US presidents descended from the same bloodline. Possessive behavior. If this is how you act with someone you've just met. How would a relationship with you be? Being rude to a waitress, cab driver, homeless person, their roommate, whoever. Don't be rude. Skipping past the get to know you conversations and going straight to get in your pants suggestions. I hate that. I am more than my ass. Thank you very much. 
talking incessantly about themselves, pooping on the street, rudeness, patronizing behavior, arrogance, talking about exes, like seriously if you ain't over them then take that somewhere else and away from me. Overtly flirting with others. Such a display of weak character. And the attention span of a truck bumper. Not showing compassion for animals. That's the most regular FALG can get for me. Being an hour and a half late and then wondering why I said we should do it next time when they arrived. They couldn't believe it. There was no next time. Finding out that the reason why they asked you out is because they wanted to make their ex jealous. To make it worse, she had her friend invite the ex-boyfriend as well. Calling your ex and start fighting about visitation rights in a subway. The store. Yeah, I didn't go for a second date after that. Chewing with mouth open or talking with mouth full. Being rude to wait staff. That never bodes well for a relationship. Telling me, someone who is not straight, that they're afraid of gay people. Telling me they really truly care about me. I'm sure guys may think it's sweet and nice but dude. You don't even know me. We've exchanged a few stories and jokes. If they show up on fire, just too many terrible dates have started that way. I recently went on a date with a woman who thought it was appropriate to go into a bathroom with strangers and do cocaine with them. So there's that. I would fuck that guy, I noticed. Brushed it off since it was a first date. Two years later we broken up. Unsurprisingly. Foisting their religious beliefs on you within the first three minutes. Also, inviting their ex. Girl I met. Religion is a very big part of my life. I know not everyone is religious. But it's also the reason I'm a Trump supporter. What? When they're on Reddit in the middle of our date creating a new post on Ask Reddit about first date. Red flags. Please don't bring your dad with you. Don't forget to share, like and subscribe for more content.